My name is Dan Klutt. I am on the IHSA Board of Directors and I am the principal at Wakanda High School and I am currently serving as the chair for the Committee on Students with Disabilities. Uh, the goal of the committee is to bring forth to the board uh, a recommendation as to what we can do to help students across the state of Illinois with disabilities. Uh, our first meeting we, we gathered uh, representatives from across the state uh, who are either principals or uh, athletic directors and we talked about uh, what currently is happening with students with disabilities across the state. Uh, we made the determination that we really needed some insight as to uh, the different groups that are involved and so at our second meeting today we brought in uh, various groups including uh, students, parents, different organizations uh, that serve students with disabilities in various capacities. And we were able to ask them some questions and get some information from them, uh, which is starting to give us a direction as to uh, what our recommendation might be for the board. Um, how we're servicing students, um, including them uh, already in IHSA activities, and if there's a need uh, for us to do more. And by talking to the different organizations that are out there, uh, we're able to find out that there is a lot of need uh, for students with disabilities and there are a lot of opportunities that possibly the IHSA uh, could be involved in providing. Um, we learned some wonderful things today. Uh, just you know, some highlights of, of what we got to hear uh, were from some of the current students who are participating. Uh, that Sometimes even as a, as a principal you're not always aware of what's going on and you see these students that are able to participate with able-bodied students and uh, we had a young man in golf uh, and we also had a young man who's been participating in his baseball program and both of them have physical disabilities and you know could do better than I can do. Um, we heard from a parent who was just ecstatic about the fact that she got to see her son not only participate on a cross-country team but also have a reasonable amount of success in beating someone along the way. Um, and then we got to hear some stories of some, of some folks that are currently involved in different organizations, but at one time were high school athletes themselves and wanted more opportunities and how they've gotten involved after high school and now this is their lifelong passion. And so we got to hear from those organizations on how important it is that we educate um, our community on the opportunities that are out there and the need for more involvement of these students and the passion that they have for what they believe in these, these special education students uh, be it physical disabilities or cognitive disabilities. Uh, what we'd like to bring to the board is, is some sort of recommendation as to the direction that we're going to ask the IHSA to go. Um, we've talked about a lot of different options um, and where we might go with that, the opportunities that we have for uh, students with disabilities, uh, be it at the championship level or be it at the local level. And it, it's a big issue to talk about and that's one thing our committee will probably meet uh, one more time even though it may be a phone type meeting as far as clarifying what we want to bring to the board so that we can give the, the uh, directors some direction in developing a program. But we all did agree on one thing and that is we want to see uh, IHSA move forward as a leader in providing uh, for students with disabilities. 